Yo, what up? Good morning. Good morning. How are you feeling? A bank, a pyramid, and now a spaceport. Anything goes in the cognitive world, I suppose. Anyhow, this is on a grander scale than before, so I'll have to do some research. We should get moving soon. Why don't we go to the palace today? Let me think about it. If Maruki has to hang out, I, I want to push you, but don't forget about Haru. Talk to me any time you're ready to go. I'll make sure I'm ready. All right. Depends if Maruki wants to hang out or not. After school. Hey. Fifteen days left. We don't really have time to relax, you know. You're not wrong. Hey. Soon tell I was about to target mementos. God damn you, Maruki! You just want me to fail, don't you? Motherfucker! Uh, hold on. Let me check something real quick. In regards to my social stats. Yeah. Alright, never mind. What's the button again? There we go. Are you free today? It's nothing urgent, but if you wouldn't mind dropping by the nurse's office. Go see him. Got it. Then I'll see you there. Motherfucker. Thank you. Thanks for coming today. Thanks for coming. So today I'd like to start off with our usual topic. Not had you going there, didn't I? You fucking idiot. Stupid, literal, dumbass, little stupid idiot. Idiot Joker, you thought we were going to talk about the same thing we usually talk about? Motherfucking idiot! <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna stop now. Little dumbass. You're an actual dumbass idiot Joker. Think we're talking about the same thing we usually talk about. <laughs> Come on, Con, you're in for a real treat today. I know I've had. I know it's been a while since you've had one too. I'm good on cookies, thanks. Thanks, but I should be going. <laughs> Oh no, I really want to get the right one here. Shit. Hmm. What's gonna make him happy? I'm good on cookies, thanks. Shit. Even I'm not that predictable. Oh, they found a really delicious looking buffet. It's apparently all regarded. It's probably very well regarded for all sorts of cuisines. And thanks to your input, I'm making some real progress on my paper. I'd like to take you to that buffet as a way of thanking you. How does that sound? Uh, oh really? Of course, honestly, I feel like it wouldn't be able to cover what I owe you after all you've done for me. Well, that settles it then. Wait, we're going now? Let's go. Shut over there now before they get too busy. Okay, buffet time, I suppose. Now. All right, now this is all on me today. No holding back, please eat as much as you can. Thanks for the food, dude. Hmm, digging. Although maybe it went a bit overboard for my first trip, haha. <laughs> all right, sorry. You wouldn't mind if I talked to you about something before we eat. It's about my paper. Uh huh? Hmm? Shibuya wash? I can't say your name. Man cults. <laughs> Why does it be called man called Shib? Sh I'm gonna call you Sh Sheeb. I'm just gonna call him Sheeb, okay? Cause, oh my God, Sheeb, Shibusawa, Shibusawa, Maruki. Hmm? I knew it, Shibusawa in the flesh. What are you doing here? That's my line. It's rare to see you at a restaurant like this one. Oh, and who might this be? Oh, it's uh, how do I put it? We made a deal. A deal? Not anything shady, is it? <laughs> no, not at all. Anyway, this is Kanakun. Nice to meet you. I'm Shibu Wa Shibusawa. Shibusawa. Shibusawa is one of my colleagues back in college. Nice. He's the one who recommended I pursue a counseling career. I'm, and I hear you've been doing some good too. I catch Winnie with on go going ons every so often. Honestly, it's a big relief. You have the most. You have so much more compassion than most, but you do. You can also be a bit too carefree. <sighs> you didn't have to mention that part, but I can refute it. But anyway, tell me more about how you've been. Film me in on this guy, too. Huh? But aren't you here with others? What about them? Eh, it's fine. We just happened to swing by here. We wouldn't mind being away for a bit. And do you think you two are really going to be able to tackle all that fruit on your own? That's... What? Oh, right. 
So your student student academy, there's been a lot of news. There's been, they've been on the news an awful lot this year. I can read, I promise. So is that where you're counseling now? Yeah, but only part time. So, what are you two doing out in a place like this? It's some kind of private counseling session, right? Oh well, he's giving me a hand with my research. I just brought him here as a thank you for all his help. Research. I had to mention. I had meant to mention this earlier, but I finally that my paper is finally almost finished. Congratulations. Thank you. It's all thanks to you, though. Paper? You mean you were doing re You're still doing research for you, the one you were doing research for? You mean you're still? Yep, I'm still at it, even after all that went down. You remember what I told you that I'd finish this paper long, longer, no matter how long it took me, Maruki? Hi, you blow my mind sometimes. I swear, you gotta be the most stubborn man in the world. Hmm. It's not supposed to be a compliment. Anyway, it's not even 100% completed yet. I haven't begun pro been the peer review process. Oh, seriously? I'd be more happy to review it for you. I mean, I did perform all the peer reviews for your publications in college. Huh? Really? Of course, man, why not? In fact, that's... What? That's it. This is now officially a celebration. The meal's on me today. Oh, I can't do that. I'm supposed to be treating Kanak Kun today. Oh, don't worry too much about it. Don't you want to congratulate him too, Kanak Kun? Let's celebrate. See, he's up for it too. <laughs> I do appreciate it, but I have to say I have mixed feelings about this. Uh, don't sweet the de sweat the details. Come on, let's go for a second round. We gotta hit the meat section and vegetables and the beans! That was great. Wow, what a feast. I think I hit my calorie intake for the entire week. Oh man, I'm gonna put on an earful for piling on. I'm gonna get an earful for piling on the pounds. Hmm, by who? My girlfriend. Well, my fiance to be more exact. I'm getting married soon. Nice. I see. <laughs> Wait, married? Yep, married. Now you're the only one left from school who's still flying solo. Uh, not to pry. Sorry to pry, but I feel the need to ask. Are you still... I actually forget I said anything. <sighs> you were going to ask about Rumi, right? Don't worry, it's fine. I feel like I shouldn't pry. It's okay, there's no need. Rumi was my girlfriend back when I was still a student. Well, uh... Well, I was too spineless at the time, and we broke up in the end. Hold on. Although, it's not like a tragedy or anything. Though, she's totally happy now. It's just that I don't feel ready to enter another relationship of that sort right... Of that sort right now. You know, this is supposed to be a celebration, yet I've thoroughly killed the mood. Sorry about that. No, no, it's my bad for bringing it up in the first place. Why don't we wrap things up here? I have to say, it's really good to see you doing well. And with, you, with your paper almost finished, too. Hey, Kanak Kun, can you keep an eye on this guy for me? I mean, it's pretty rare to see him open up to someone like this. Like he has with you. You're talking to him like I'm some kind of sullen kid. But I do need to express my appreciation properly. Thank you. Thank you so much for helping someone like me make the dreams come true, Kanak Kun. I sense Maruki's trust and in, intense trust in me. All right. Nice. Well, should we get going? Don't forget to send me pa that paper, okay? I'm seriously gonna review it for you. Uh, I won't. I'll be in touch soon. Be careful, okay? Thanks for spending so much time with me. Make make sure you're careful on your way home. On the way home. Hey, it's me. I was supposed to treat you today, huh? Sorry things didn't go as planned. Shibuyu... Shib Shibuyu? Shibuyu? Has always been quick to offer me his help. Mm, well, maybe it's because he knows I'm a little careless, though. He's a good friend. That's true. He actually helped me out a lot. Running into Shibuya was quite a coincidence, but a very lucky one. He was the best in the department when it came to peer reviews. Maybe you bring me good luck with him. Oh, I did not mean to say that. Uh, say that. Skip that. Maybe you bring me good luck with him, or maybe I'm doing 
too much magical thinking. We'll see you later. Ah, you're back. Yo. A uh, box came for you. Hey. What'd you get? I got my calming aroma, my smoke screen, and my lock picks. Let's go. Oh. Yep, must be what you ordered off TV. No one wants to hang out with me again today either. Sojiro does. Hell yeah. I'm going to go get Kawakami to do some laundry for me, because why not? Okay. I literally have zero reason to do laundry by myself today. Laundry got it, leave it to me. Bye! I'm such a nice boyfriend. <laughs> I'm gonna go hang out with my guardian now. Bye, idiot. <laughs> no. Ooh. If you have time, can you help me prepare the diner? I feel like my bond Sojiro will go stronger soon. It's been a while since I've hung out with Sojiro. Are you gonna do? Are you gonna help the chief out? Help him out. All right then. Thanks, Futaba's coming to eat today too. I'll get the co hurry ready. I'm leaving coffee to you. All right. <laughs> Phew! I'm wicked full. How was the curry, Futaba? Delicious. I'm gonna be dreaming of that stuff tonight. Huh? Did you taste? Did it taste the same? You remember it? Yep. I feel like a dummy for not wanting to eat back when I was depressed about my mom. Oh yeah, the first episode of brand new anime I want to watch is airing tonight. I'm out of here. Eyes in front of you walk when you walk, okay? No spacing out. You ran head first into a pole last time you went for a walk. Well, you stubbed your toe on the dresser the other day. Oh crap, it's gonna start. Making like a leaf and eh, screw it. Bye! See you later, Fudaba. That's why we had to wait for uh, the game to <laughs> for the game to progress. Uh, before we can hang out with Sojiro, because Futaba is, part, is a big part in his confidant, which makes sense. It's his fucking daughter. And what about you? Uh, I think I'm addicted. <laughs> really? I guess you have pretty good taste if you understand how incredible that curry is. Now then, it's probably something I should tell you. Take a seat. I'll pour you some coffee. Yeah. Remember how I said the recipe for my curry was developed by a scientific genius? You may realize it by now, but that genius was Futaba's monitor, Wakaba. In other words, the curry was one of the last remaining connections Futaba has with her mom. Damn. First time I met Wakaba back when she was doing work for the government, she was in real trouble, let me tell you. Logic prevailed over emotion for her, and she had an integrated knowledge of the human mind. I, th I thought my best my new pickup line the best in town not a single one worked on her <laughs> was she like Futaba she was a normal huh so that's why you're a bachelor was she like Futaba you could say that it was never clear what she was thinking so I had a hard time trying to keep up with her men are idiots though we spend time and time chasing after things we can't get Waka rejected me time and time again. There was one instance I managed to surprise her. And that's when I gave her a plate of my homemade curry. The very next day she came the very next day she came asking about what ingredients go through the cooking process. And a few days later she handed me a scientifically enhanced version of my recipe. It was incredible. She used my curry as a basis, but it was miles better than anything I'd made. Curry was Wakaba's specialty from then on. Naturally, Futaba grew to love it in no time as well. And then after Wakaba's accident, Futaba stopped eating it entirely. The flavor would make her remember the pain. This even, I even, I heard even smells can bring back memories too. But that curry was the only point of connection I had with Futaba. That's why when I took her in, I vowed to keep the recipe alive until she could eat it again. Really paid off in the end. Almost brings paid my eye. So much history. So much history behind a, behind a little plate of curry. Damn. Really paid off in the end. Yeah, I felt like a huge weight was lifted off my shoulders when she said it was delicious. The whole idea of pairing the curry with a nice brew is thanks to Wakaba's refinement too. Despite how introverted she seemed, she was really extraordinarily 
extraordinarily perceptive of the people around her. I never even told her about my love of coffee. She just figured it out just from looking at me. I was totally realized she was totally out. Is when I realized she was totally out of my league. Aww. Not like I really stood a chance to begin with, though. She already had Futaba by then, after all. This might seem like an old Kurt to most people, but there are tons of emotions crammed inside. So uh, make sure you keep the tradition going. I feel like my bond with Sojiro is growing deeper. Nice. All right. <laughs> All right, that's enough for this tonight. Things are starting to get downright sappy in here. If I was waiting for me at home too, I probably should be heading the back. Is on you. Make sure you clean up before you go to bed. Oh yeah, I get kindness from hanging out with him. I should have fucking paid 5,000 yen to get thingies. You can see the compassion hidden behind Sojiro's action. I feel my kindness growing. Rank up, rank up, rank up, rank up. Oh yeah, actually, I don't even need a rank. I don't need a rank up anymore, actually. I am level four. I can go work at the fucking thing in Idea Target at the bar. God damn, I'm an idiot. I gotta go do that. <clears throat> Hey, it's me. You finished cleaning up? I heard I was still watching anime. As long as she's in a good mood, though, I don't mind it. Seeing her happy is what makes me glad I kept Wakaba's curry alive. There's only a problem when she asks for it three times a day. She needs a balanced diet. That's exactly the problem. Furtaba's still growing. I gotta be strict with her. She needs to eat balanced meals which, so she gets vitamins that curry can't give her. I mean, but man, the expression on Furtaba's face when she takes a, took a bite of that curry... Ah, uh, forget it. Maybe I'll have to stick a curry with a staple. I'll sneak some vegetables here and there. I guess cooking really can be the labor of love. Ah, oh, crap. I talk too much. See you later, I guess. Yeah, just sneak some vegetables in. Curry is curry is very easy to be healthy. Like, very easy to make a healthy Hi. food. Just put some vegetables in. Maybe tone down sauces with a whole bunch of, like, anything that you add to it that gives it sodium. Like, curry can be a basis. And then, like, the special curry, like the... Like the traditional one you make, the one that Wakaba's, that Wakaba like scientifically improved. That one could be a treat or something like that. Futaba is like 15, so she has to 15, 16, somewhere around there. So she she needs vegetables. Actually, anyone needs vegetables. PSA: Eat your vegetables. <laughs> be healthy. <laughs> See you later. Bye bye.